Soviet Union continues to expand in both military might and political influence. Soviet Russia holds a commanding position in the future destiny of the world. But it was the United States that held the secret to atomic power. The flags of freedom fly all over the world. His superiority would be short-lived, however, as Stalin was already at work on a plan of his own. While searching for uranium on a tiny island off the southeast coast of the Soviet Union, Russian engineers discovered E-99, a powerful and unprecedented source of energy. Seeing an opportunity for further world domination, Stalin authorizes unlimited development funds to explore the capacities of the substance. Project director Viktor Barasov establishes an island research station, Gatorga 12. For his groundbreaking research, he receives the Order of Lenin. When Nikita Khrushchev succeeds Stalin, he accelerates the program, pressuring Barasov to begin field experiments. However, not only is E-99 capable of delivering unimagined power, it is also incredibly volatile. Yet Barasov is pressured to begin tests. Disaster has no known survivors. Moscow buries the installation, effectively wiping it from the map. 2010. A U.S. spy satellite flying over the area is blinded by a radiation surge. Fearing another Chernobyl, and suspicious of Moscow's secrecy, the reconnaissance mission over Katorga 12 is ordered by the Pentagon. Titan 1 Actual here. What's your status, Captain? It got punched out. Copters down and we're scattered. Don't know how many KIAs yet. Over. Satellite's got you about 30 clicks south of a radio tower. Get your team there, Captain. We're pulling you out. Understood, sir. Spartan team, if you copy, switch your comm gear to TAC-3. Meet up at the rally point.
are here. The village area contains the civilian docks, where new personnel first arrive on Katorga 12. It is home to many of the inhabitants of the island and features a school that offers the best in Russian education. The industrial docks are where supplies are brought in from the mainland. Hundreds of tons of equipment and material are offloaded here every day. Once construction is completed, the tower will be home to the Borisov reactor. This powerful device will generate a singularity, an event horizon that will provide the Soviet Union with unlimited energy that is both clean and safe. The processing facilities are where E-99 ore is purified and enriched. In order to protect the civilian population from any potential radioactivity, security is very high. The rail line is where vast amounts of supplies and research materials are moved across the island. It also serves as the main transportation of raw E-99 ore. The research laboratories are where scientific investigation is done into the potential uses of E-99. Some of the areas of experimentation include weapons development, crop regeneration, and medical research as well as chronology investigation. some miracle you're alive and hearing this. Rally at the base of the radio tower we passed over before we got bounced. SNR's running carpool from there. Double time it. Move!
damage. What happened? What did you do? <coughs> what did I do? Nothing. He almost died in there. <coughs> Fortunately, he saved me.
911 if you're receiving. I'm in what looks like a school, and there's some guy... Holy mother! Dr. Demichev has told us the equipment they're installing at the school is safe, but I'm worried. I have a friend who works at one of the animal testing labs, and he told me E-99 mutates living flesh. How could they expose the children to something like that?
silent to study it. You see, our scientists think that someday they will be able to use E-99 to accomplish some pretty amazing things. Like taking barren farmland and making it productive again. Or taking a sick man and making him a super soldier. They even hope Another event, this one much worse than the last. It has exceeded Barisol's threshold. We are securing the facility, and then we will make our way down the hill. We must leave Katorga 12 at once.
long, I'd be dead. All right, we're supposed to meet up with SNR yesterday. Let's move on. Copy Titan 1. Titan 1, this is Devlin 4 1 on guard frequency. Please respond. Are we good to go with extraction? People are gathering at the gate to the docks. Word is spreading that there isn't enough room on the guard boats. If only we still had the pearl. Stick to the plan. Get to the radio tower. Maybe we can salvage equipment there if we need it. How could Intel have been so wrong? I mean, this place is anything but abandoned. Something's not right. We should at least be able to hear the Titan one broadcasting. Search and rescue teams better be on their friggin' way right now. Let's go. Uniform's a little different from what I've seen, but this is definitely a Russian soldier. No question. Let's go. Then cover me. On me. All clear. Break go. Break right. I'll go left.
There's the radio tower. Let's contact Titan One and get out of this circle, jerk. On me. It's 86th. Go check out that guard post. Maybe there's another switch. Ask your mic, head back to my position. Shit, four of those things. Grab that rifle, we gotta clear a path. Nice shoot! Let's move! Chopper! And it's not one of ours! Get down! for any more of those creatures. People have turned on the guards. Many are dead. Most the others have fled deeper into the island. I must find my Nadia.
finally. Jesus, it's like an antique show here. Titan 1, this is Devlin 4 1 actual. Do you copy? Titan 1, this is Devlin 4 1 actual. We're primed for extraction. Again with the Russians. Say again, this is Devlin 4 1. Oh, they must be jamming our comms. It's all Russian all the time. Does anything work on this goddamn island? Of course not. Who the hell is this? Shit, these guys don't look friendly. I'm having a really bad day. Push up! Captain Renko. You are Captain Renko, are you not? Don't look so surprised. Your name's right on your uniform. America's charming pension for individuality. Now, I have some questions for you. Name, rank, and serial number. That's all you get from us, Ivan. Check your Geneva Convention handbook. I did away with that little inconvenience years ago. <laughs> United States military. I want to talk to someone in our embassy. I think you'll find that impossible for a number of reasons. Our embassy, right now! That's better. How is it you haven't aged a day in 50 years? There is only one explanation. The TMD, where is it?
quickly, down the stairs. Nathaniel Renko. My god, you're here. Just like Mir-12 said. You must have a lot of questions, but we don't have a lot of time. Quickly, this way. My name is Catherine. I belong to an organization known as Mir-12. Here. This should all... We are Mir-12. Our mission is to reveal the truth that's been hidden from the entire world. In the 1950s, a military research base was built on the island of Katorga-12. To this day, the government denies its existence. That is a lie. According to top-secret documents we've uncovered, the base was the site of research involving the mineral E-99. The E-99 research program was headed by two men, Dr. Viktor Barasov, a top researcher in the field of quantum physics. He didn't live to see the outcome of his work. Reports say he was killed in an unexplained laboratory accident. This man stepped in to lead the program after Barasov's death. He went on to lead Russia in a war for world domination. A war won using super-powered weaponry developed at Katorga-12. Today, we know him as Chancellor Nikolai Demichev, leader of the world government. The events surrounding Demichev's rise to power are still a mystery. Our organization is in possession of a journal that claims Demichev is a fraud. It raises many questions about Katorga-12. What happened there to put Chancellor Demichev in power? What could have caused so much destruction and taken so many lives? Evidence points to this structure on Katorga-12. The Singularity. What is the Singularity? The journal claims one man will lead us to the answers. His name is Captain Nathaniel Renko. It is our mission to locate Captain Renko and help him achieve his goal. We are mere 12. We will reveal the truth. One of the lead scientists on the Singularity Project built a hidden vault. You must find it. Go through there. Here, two-way communicator with GPS. Now go!